I got asked for the pH of a one millimolar NaOH solution. It's your job to know what millimolar means. Milli is code for one thousandth of the original unit, and one thousandth means times 10 to the negative three. So one millimolar is one times 10 to the negative three moles per liter of NaOH, which I hope you can identify as a strong base. What that means is that every single NaOH that dissolves into the water gives you an OH minus. What that means is that you end up with the exact same concentration of OH minus ions in solution. Hopefully that already tells you what you need to know. Because the pOH of a solution is the negative log of the OH minus concentration. That's the negative log of one times 10 to the negative three. Now, if you don't know how to deal with logs, I do, so I know what answer I'm supposed to get here. You can type it into your calculator. That's the negative log of one times 10 to the power of negative three. There, see how I typed it all? Beautiful. It's three. That's not a coincidence. That's how logs work. I got a pOH of three, but of course you didn't come here for the pOH. No one uses that in the real world. The pH is 14 minus the pOH, as long as you're at room temperature. So 14 minus three gives you a pH of 11, which makes sense because it's a base. So you're supposed to be in a basic pH, more than seven. That's it, less than two minutes to calculate that. Hopefully you can do it yourself on the test. Am I right? Best of luck.